we're gonna make a delicious breakfast casserole. This is so easy, it comes together so fast, and I like to food prep. So this is gonna be uh, breakfast for Eric and I pretty much for the next four days. So I've got a dozen eggs. I'm just gonna whisk these up nice and easy. I find it's easy if you just kind of poke them first. Don't poke me, I'm telling. Kind of get those yolks to break up a little bit and then they just seem to whisk a little bit easier. Okay, so I just have a little mixture of butter and a little bit of avocado oil in there heating up. And this is eight ounces of breakfast sausage. Love it. And the great thing is I have another half of that for another casserole down the road. I love making these. If you've watched any of our other videos, uh, you'll know that Eric and I really love our tater tots. And this is such a delicious and easy casserole to make. You could even do this the night before if you wanted. Like say you were having company over, you could get this all assembled, put it in the fridge, and then just bake it off the next morning. It'd be totally fine. So all I'm going to do right now is just going to brown the sausage. It's going to take about eight minutes or so to get this going. I am going to add a little pinch of salt, a little bit of ground black pepper, just so we season every layer as we go. Even though this is simple, we want to have a lot of flavor. Okay, so I'm going a little bit of the pepper. Perfect. And we'll let this cook up. So the sausage is done. I'm just gonna shut it off. You just wanna make sure the sausage is cooked through and brown just a little bit. I'm just gonna put it in a separate dish because I want it to cool slightly before we assemble the casserole. Right. Okay, so our oven's preheated to 350. The sausage is already cooked. I've got 12 eggs whisked up. This is just a half a cup of whole milk going in. And then a little seasoning. So this is three quarter teaspoon of Italian seasoning. This half a teaspoon of kosher salt, half a teaspoon of garlic powder, and a quarter teaspoon of ground black pepper. All going in, just giving us some flavor there. And you could make this so many different ways. This is just a real quick and simple one, but you could put sauteed onions and bell peppers. You could put mushrooms in there, it'd be delicious. You could make it all vegetarian if, if you wanted. All, all good. So just gonna get that nice and combined. And then I'm just gonna show you how we're gonna finish this off and assemble the casserole. Okay, so I already butted a nine by 13 casserole dish. It's gonna put the mixture, the egg mixture all inside. I'm gonna stir, and this is two cups of shredded chopped cheddar. You could use whatever kind you like. Again, just going in. And then I'm gonna add the sausage right on top. So the sausage going in, and I'm gonna give this all just a little stir. Get it all combined. I mean, you see this comes together in minutes, right? Just gonna make sure everything's kind of evenly distributed there. Getting nice and cheesy and good. All right, I think we're good. Okay, so this is a 32 ounce bag of those golden puffs of goodness. We won't use quite the whole bag, but listen, I will always find another use for them. Pauline, give me some of your tots. No, go find your own. So you can be, you know, really dainty with these. I just like, throw them in. I just don't have that kind of patience. I know I've seen some people and they look so beautiful. They have them all like in a row. Good for them, right? I just don't, I can't do it. Ain't nobody got time for that. I am gonna try to maximize them, get as many on there as I can, because it is so crunchy and delicious. These are great for a crowd, if you're having a brunch, right? Put some fruit along the side. You could top this with bacon. You could top it with scallions. I mean, it really is kind of, all up to you and the things that you like. Okay, it's going in the oven. 50 minutes to one hour total. All right, see you in a bit. Okay, well, casserole is done. It smells so good in here. You saw how easy that was to put together. And now we're gonna have breakfast for the rest of the week. All right, Eric, you wanna try some? Yeah. Give it a little taste. And then the great thing is I can pre-package this tonight, so I don't have to do anything for the rest of the week. We can just grab and go in the morning. All right. You know I love tater tots. Oh, I know, me too. And I know. And the eggs. Right, some sausage. Stuff, what I just dig in? Yeah. I look like nobody will even know. They're gonna know. Nobody's gonna know. They're gonna know. <laughs> I don't care. Ooh, very hot. Very hot. We are cooking in this kitchen. I already have flesh hanging down from the pizza the other day, so <laughs> might as well. We've all done that. <laughs> all right. Mmm, smells so good. Mm. 
I could eat that for breakfast mm -hmm. or dinner. Okay. Or anytime. Yeah, breakfast for dinner, we love doing mm. that as well. But anyways, hope you enjoy this. If you have not subscribed, please do. And if you have, thank you so much for following. And look, we look forward to next videos with you. Enjoy.